like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. Humans have been obsessed with the destruction of Earth and mass extinction for quite some time now. Historically, there have been just five major events of mass extinction, so another such event happening soon is highly unlikely. But hey, there's always a possibility. So today, we're looking at the top 10 things that could destroy the Earth. Number one might happen in your lifetime, so watch out for that. Number 10. Nuclear War at the top of the list, we have an event you're probably very familiar with. In the case of World War III, which is more likely than any other event on this list, the world would suffer a lot. The good news here, quote unquote good, is that nuclear war could only end humanity under very special circumstances. The United States bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki in World War II were humanitarian catastrophes, but couldn't result in humans going extinct. An even bigger such event might not kill everyone on the planet. But there is another sinister thing about nuclear war that you probably don't know about. It's the possibility of nuclear winter. That is, if enough nukes are detonated, world temperatures would fall dramatically and quickly, disrupting food production and possibly rendering human life impossible. People who survive will just be living in hell, and the world would need centuries to get back to normal. How scary is that? Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number nine, asteroid hit. At number three, we have something that you've probably seen a hundred times before in movies. Getting hit by an asteroid is every Hollywood director's wet dream, which is hard to take the event seriously. But there's no question that if something were to hit Earth, we won't have to wait millions of years for it to happen. In 1908, a 200-foot wide comet fragment slammed into the atmosphere and exploded over the Tunguska region in Siberia, Russia, with nearly 1,000 times the energy of the atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima. Astronomers estimate similar-sized events occur every one to three centuries. Scientists claim that impacts have repeatedly disturbed human civilization. As an example, one killed 10,000 people in the Chinese city of Jiyingyang in 1490. Objects more than a half a mile wide, which strike Earth every 250,000 years or so, would touch off firestorms, followed by global cooling from dust kicked up by the impact. Humans would likely survive, but civilization might not. An asteroid five miles wide would cause major extinctions, like the one that may have marked the end of the age of dinosaurs. What would you do in such an event? Number eight, global pandemic. Two years ago, no one even knew about what a pandemic was, except for nerds, obviously. But now, COVID has one of the most searched words on Google. We've already seen the power and wrath of a pandemic, and how much it can have an impact on human life. Could another pandemic destroy the planet? Well, it's a complicated question. Past pandemics, like the Black Death or the Spanish Flu of 1918, have killed tens of millions of people, but failed to halt civilization. And now, COVID-19 killed a few million people, but due to advancements in technology, we were able to curb the virus better than before. But on the flip side, imagine if two or three viruses, much more lethal than any virus before, get discovered. That would result in the death of millions of people, even more than ever before. Even a pandemic that killed off most of humanity would surely leave a few survivors who have immunity to the disease. The risk isn't that a single contagion kills everyone, it's that a pandemic kills enough people, the world suffers and takes centuries to get back on track. Not a pretty sight, right? Number seven, robots taking over. This is something people have been fearing for decades now. You know how the story goes. Smart people create smart robots, which turn against us and take over the world. We've been seeing this in movies, TVs, and comic books for decades. Many theorists estimate that by 2040, machines will match human intelligence and perhaps human consciousness. Then they'll get even better and start taking over, as with colonial Britain. Whether this counts as the end of humanity or the next stage in evolution depends on your point of view. Number six, alien invasion. 
At the SETI Institute in Mountain View, California, dedicated scientists examine through radio static in search of a telltale signal from an alien civilization. So far, nothing. Now, suppose long-sought messages arrive. Not only do the aliens exist, but they're also about to stop by for a visit. And then, any science fiction devotee can tell you what could go wrong, and how the aliens could take over and destroy our planet. Aliens might want resources from our solar system and slap us aside if we get in the way. Or, aliens might accidentally upset our planet or solar system while carrying out some grandiose interstellar construction project. But, many believe they could come with a peace offering. A lot could go wrong with aliens visiting us, but many believe they could come with a peace offering and technology that we have not yet discovered. What would you do if there was an alien invasion? Number 5. Super Volcano Have you heard of the Super Volcano before? Believe us, it's as scary as it sounds. As with asteroids, there are historical examples of volcanic eruptions causing mass extinction. The Permian-Triassic extinction event, which is believed to have caused something like 90% of the Earth's species to go extinct, is believed to have been caused by a super volcanic eruption. You would be thinking about how a huge volcano can impact the whole Earth, because even a super volcano cannot spread thousands of miles. Eruptions can cause significant global cooling and can disrupt agricultural production. They're also basically impossible to prevent, at least today, though they're also extremely rare. Another Permian-Triassic-level eruption is extremely unlikely on human timescales, but the damage from even a smaller eruption could affect the climate, damage the biosphere, affect food supplies, and create political instability. The event might not kill everyone on Earth, but it would definitely be a living hell for everyone who survives it. Number 4. Destruction of the Ozone Layer Extremely powerful outbursts of energy called gamma ray bursts can be caused by binary star systems and exploding stars. These energy bursts are extremely powerful because they focus their energy on a narrow beam lasting no longer than seconds or minutes. The resulting radiation from one could damage or destroy our ozone layer leaving life vulnerable to the sun's harsh UV radiation. And once that happens, you know what that'll cause. Destruction. It will cause massive climate change events that can result in the melting of ice and floods around the world. Cities would sink and millions would suffer from the rays and its direct impacts. Astronomers have discovered a star system, WR-104, that could host such an event. WR-104 is about 5,200 to 7,500 light years away. You might think that's too far, but believe us, it's not far enough to be safe. And we can only guess when the burst will happen. Luckily, there's the possibility that the beam could miss us entirely when it does. Don't worry, whenever it does happen, you won't be around to witness it. Number 3. Solar Flare the sun is not a peaceful star at all, as you might imagine. It creates strong magnetic fields that generate impressive sunspots, sometimes many times larger than Earth. It also ejects a stream of particles and radiation, solar wind. If kept in check by Earth's magnetic field, this wind can cause beautiful northern and southern lights, which we humans are very obsessed with. But when it becomes stronger, it can also influence radio communication or cause power outages. The most powerful magnetic solar storm documented hit Earth in 1859. The incident, called the Carrington Event, caused huge interference with rather small-scale electronic equipment. Such events must have happened several times in the past, too, with humans surviving. But only in recent years have we become entirely dependent on electronic equipment. The truth is, we would suffer greatly if we underestimate the dangers of a possible Carrington, or even more powerful event. Even though this would not wipe out humanity instantly, it would represent an immense challenge. There would be no electricity, heating, air conditioning, GPS, or internet. Imagine having to live off canned food for the rest of your days. Tragic, no? And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by one of our subscribers. If you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in a future video. Number two, the sun exploding. Like we said before, our sun is not as peaceful as you'd think. The sun is a star, and when a star explodes, it's called a supernova. 
These types of explosions are very bright and very powerful. They release lots of dust into space, which is used to make more stars and planets. Even our solar system was made this way. And you know the even crazier part? We humans are also made of star stuff. So what if the sun decided one day that it had enough and just explodes? What would happen? Well, it's simple. The whole solar system would be destroyed, including our precious Earth. You don't have to worry too much, though, as stars 10 times the size of our sun or bigger could explode like this. Our sun will end its life in a different way. Our precious sun will start to die when it runs out of fuel in about 5 billion years. This is 77 times longer than the Tyrannosaurus Rex has been extinct. So, a very, very long time. Number 1. Black Holes Let's start with our favorite thing in space, black holes. We're all familiar with a black hole. It's a void space everyone wants to be sucked in. Our galaxy is full of black holes, collapsed stellar corpses just a dozen miles wide. After all, they're called black holes for a reason. Their gravity is so strong, they swallow everything, even the light that might betray their presence. Researchers guesstimate that there are 10 million black holes in the Milky Way alone. These objects orbit just like other stars, meaning that it is not terribly likely that one is headed our way. But if it were to kill all of us, scientists believe it wouldn't be a problem for the black hole. What's interesting is that the black hole wouldn't have to come all that close to Earth to bring ruin. Just passing through the solar system would distort all of the planet's orbits. Earth might get drawn into an elliptical path that would cause extreme climate swings, or it might be ejected from the solar system and go roaming in some other solar system, obviously destroying all life on Earth. Which one of these events do you think is the most likely to happen? Let us know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.